Hello, this is Professor Sampson, and in this video, we will be learning how to change an improper fraction into a mixed number. Now, again, as in the last video, uh, you can have the upgrade, which allows you to use the fraction menu, or you can do it without that. So we're going to work on both ways. All right, so let's say, for example, I have 99 over 10. And I want to change that into a mixed number, which is a whole number and a fraction. If I do not have the upgrade, right, the first step I'm going to do is just divide it, right? So I'm just going to put in my calculator, 99 divided by 10, all right? And my whole number right here before the decimal is going to be my whole number, how many times it actually goes in. Right. So since I use my whole number, I'm just going to subtract that out. So you're going to subtract out your whole number. Okay. So once you subtract out the whole number, you see you're left with a decimal. And anytime you have a decimal, of course, to change a decimal to a fraction, you hit math, enter, enter. And when you hit math, enter, enter, it's going to change that decimal and we're going to call it me, math, enter, enter. It's going to change that decimal in a fraction, which is 9 over 10. So there you go. You have your mixed number, 9 and 9 tenths. If you wanted to check it and see if it worked, again, it would be 10 times 9, which is 90, plus 9, which is 99 over the same denominator. All right. Now let's see if you have your upgrade, and we wanted to do 19 over 3. So this next example would be 19 over 3. If you had 19 over 3 and you wanted to change that into a mixed number, um, you can go to your fraction menu, which is the alpha y equals key. Remember that menu? All right. And we're going to be working with the second one. But we have to have a fraction first. All right. So we have 19 over 3. And from our 19 over 3, we're going to go back into our menu, and we're going to change that 19 over 3 by using number 3. We're going to change that into a mixed number, which is 6 and 1 over 3. So let's try that with another one so that you know what's going on. Again, this is if you have the upgrade. If you don't have the fraction menu, then you do what we said before. All right? So let's say if you had 32 over 9. All right, you got 32 over 9. You're going to go into your fraction menu since it's a fraction. Alpha y equals number 1. That's where you're going to fill in 32 over 9. You always want to go over to clear it. Now you're telling the calculator, I need to take 32 over 9, and I need to switch that into a mixed number. So I go back to my alpha y equals menu, and I select number 3. Number 3 is how you change a mix a uh, fraction into a mixed number. So I'm going to hit number 3 or hit enter. As you see, that comes up once I hit enter again, and I'm going to get 3 and 5 over 9. Again, if I wanted to do this same one without using it, I would have my 32 over 9. I would subtract out my whole number, which is 3, minus 3. And then I would hit math, enter, enter, to change the rest of that decimal that's left into 5 ninths. Please do not try to type this out, this decimal. Just subtract out the whole number and then hit math, enter, enter. And that is how I change my fraction into a mixed number, whether I have the upgrade or not, using the TI-84 or the 83. The 83 would not have the upgrade, so that you would have to do this part, divide, and then subtract by the whole number.